forget young people. Your version of the hallelujah. Go and sing it. Hallelujah. could just share with us some now. Well, the people tell me that I'm trying to look like Jesus. I can't think of anybody else I'd rather look like. <laughs> Jesus, he changed my life. And I, I kind of relate it to like David the psalmist when he says that thou hast lifted me up from the dunghill and he has placed my feet on a solid rock. And since then, I'm all cleaned up now. <laughs> and... Isn't that a wonderful feeling? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and only Jesus could have done it. That's right. He's, he's, give, he's given me a message in my heart. And that, that's a message. He says, go ye into all the world and preach the gospel. He said in his word to me, I would receive power after that the Holy Ghost would come upon me. And I waited upon the Lord, and the Holy Ghost came upon me, all right. <laughs> yeah, I got it down to the tips of my toes. And, and so the message is that these are the last days, and that Jesus Christ is returning really soon. And the prophet Joel and the prophet Peter said that in the last days, that God would pour out his Spirit upon all flesh, 
that his sons and daughters would prophesy and that his servants and handmaidens would speak forth the anointed word of God. I'm a servant of God and I'm a child of God and God is raising up from the very bottom and he's raising up the, the foolish and what the world considers That's dumb right. yeah. and he's, he's putting his spirit upon him and he's anointing him and they're starting to preach the gospel and thousands of people are starting to get saved everywhere and so it's thrilling it sure is <laughs> and so because these are the last days God has chosen himself some prophets and the church for so long has been expecting a certain mold of, of what a Christian should look like or what a Christian should be or what a Christian should say and God is blowing everybody's mind <laughs> because he's saving he's saving the the hippies and nobody thought a hippie could be saved <laughs> and so he's pulled us up he's given us the message we're going forth and proclaiming the good news Jesus is coming back repent and turn to the Lord and save yourselves from this evil generation because he comes to judge the quick and the dead how has he changed your life Lonnie well, the Lord says, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. All things pass away, and behold, all things become new. He's changed me all around. Really? Inside out, through and through. <laughs> <laughs> and the things you once loved, you have no desire for at all, right? Just went right out. And he says, I'll take your stony heart of unbelief, and I'll put a new heart within you, and place my spirit within you, too. And so everything changes. He says, I'll become a well of living water gushing forth from within you, and that well of living water gets out everything else. And the new birth experience is real. Sure is. <laughs> it's the most real thing in the world. He's really, really real. <laughs> How many of you know what Lonnie's talking about? Yeah. yeah.